Accrington's flying start against Gillingham suggested they were keen to move on quickly following John Coleman's departure. Michael Smith's first for the club inside a minute, no doubt calming the nerves of caretaker manager Liam Richardson. But the standing boss was back at square one just six minutes later. Danny Jackman's fantastic free kick had the Kent club back on terms. Just a minor setback, though, for a team who'd suffered just one defeat in their previous ten outings. Peter Murphy's cross picked out Smith, who notched his second to restore Stanley's advantage. By the half hour, Gillingham were already tumbling towards a third successive league defeat. A peach of a strike from Luke Joyce put the home side firmly in control. Uncomfortable viewing for Andy Hessenthaler, who's promised to reimburse the 261 fans that made the trip. The Jules boss left to count the cost of more slack defending as Smith nipped in to complete a first-half hat-trick. A fine display from the Charlton Loney left the Jules with a mountain to climb, who at least made a fist of it after the restart. There didn't seem to be too much danger as Ian Dumbavin prepared to clear Stanley's lines, but a howler from the home keeper allowed Gavin Tomlin to cut the deficit. Five minutes from time, Tomlin hit the target again, but for the second week running, the Jills score three and get nothing. Accrington are into the playoff places. Well, let's take a look at the league tables after Saturday's games then. In Empower League 2, we have new leaders with Cheltenham Town hitting top spot for the first time, so well done to them. Shrewsbury and Torquay both move up a place after wins on Saturday, while Accrington will enjoy looking at the table tonight as they move up into the playoff places. At the bottom, Northampton's miserable form continues, so they continue to prop up the rest. They're joined in the bottom two by Plymouth, who also lost. Things are looking marginally better for the Daggers, though. Their vital win against Rotherham at least gives them a tiny bit of breathing.